Hi everyone, Lydia here, and welcome back to my channel. This is the place where you don't need to start rich to become financially free. Go check out the link below. Family Fortress is the best gift to give your elderly loved ones. Everyone is using ChatGPT and AI and scammers are also taking advantage of these tools. So Family Fortress is one of the best gifts that you could give a loved one, especially an elderly loved one today for less than the price of a cup of coffee. So thank you so much for watching this video. If you haven't already, give me a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button and the notification bell to stay tuned for when I make new videos. And so today I want to talk to you about something super, super, super important and really relevant with all the technology and AI technology development that's going on. I had a very personal experience recently where somebody called my grandmother pretending to be me in a crisis and asking for $5,000 to help pay for my medical bills. And my grandma, knowing that I was on vacation and that I wasn't driving anywhere on this vacation, she immediately knew that this was a scam and she, she wasn't fooled. However, it was very convincing. She actually thought about giving them the money and not every elderly person comes out unscathed. So today in this episode, we are gonna talk about protecting not only the financial health and wealth of yourself, but also your loved ones, and particularly the elderly mem members of your family who are extremely vulnerable to high-tech thieves who are using modern technology and the availability and access of information to thwart your loved ones out of their hard-earned money that they need for their retirement and to pay for all of their living expenses. So in that, I want to get into what I call the Family fortress, okay? So I actually went out and I consulted cybersecurity experts and CEOs and other wealthy people who need to protect their assets from these high-tech thieves. And what did they all tell me? Make a family password. Let's get into the family fortress. What is it? You could easily go out and write your family password down yourself and just keep it somewhere next to your desk or in a journal. It's really helpful to have something that you can actually look at, especially if you're 70, 75 years old. You want something that you can easily find that will help you identify the top scams, what they look like, how to look out for them, and immediately see your family password there on the bottom. So what I've done for less than the price of a cup of coffee is make the family fortress available for you. Check it out. I think that it would be a great excuse for a family meeting and to come up with a relevant password that will help protect you and your loved ones from these high tech thieves. I basically didn't want to just sit around and let somebody scam my family. So we use the family fortress to sit down and we came up with relevant passwords and the order in which we will use them throughout the year to keep things more relevant. Now this one page document, something that you can print so that you do not send your password in an email, in a text message, it needs to be something that's only spoken over the phone and perhaps just written down on a piece of paper so that it's not anywhere online that thieves who may have potentially hacked your email or other accounts can have access to. The fact that I could just Google you or anyone else's name and find out the age of all of your family members, who you're related to, where you live, uh, it's it's pretty crazy how much information is freely available about all of us, especially Americans. We tend to be highly, highly targeted for scams and online crime. So if you're in the US and you're watching this video, we all like to think that, ah, this wouldn't happen to me. This is something that you know I hear about on the news, or maybe you've already experienced it. And if you have, please feel free to tell me your story in the comments below. I'd be curious to know, but just to make sure that, hey, you're protected in case it does happen to you, because I thought the same way that this wouldn't happen to me when I found out that someone was pretending to be me and asking my grandmother for $5,000, I felt very personally attacked and so I wanted to do something about it. And I'm here to tell you that I've made an easy one page infographic that you can store your family password, identify all those common scams to protect you and your loved ones, and then some tips and tricks for keeping your password safe and as high security as possible. Things like don't use birthdays and stuff that can be easily found online. You wanna make sure it's something that's kind of intimate and private that only the family would really know amongst themselves. Family Fortress is one of the best gifts that you could give a loved one, especially an elderly loved one today, for less than the price of a cup of coffee. So thank you so much for watching this video. If you haven't already, give me a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button and the notification bell to stay tuned for when I make new videos. In the next video, we're going to be talking about automating your budget, how to buy property, and all of the other ways you can help invest and diversify your money today. So with that, thank you, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace. <laughs>